In this video, we are going to watch fecal emulsification of a cataract with grade 3 nuclear sclerosis. This is the main incision with a 2.8 millimeter steel keratome. And now, 2 percent hydroxypropyl methyl cellulose is injected into the anterior chamber. It is not applied over the cornea in this case. This is a side port on the left side of the main incision. And now, capsulorexis is done with the help of a uterata forceps. Visibility is quite good with anticlockwise movements of the capsular tag, the rexis is completed. Hydrodissection is done with a 27 gauze cannula and basis. The nucleus is rotated. And now, visco again, filling up the anterior chamber, and then the phaco needle is introduced into the anterior chamber. The machine being used is Oatly Catarex 3. The phaco needle goes in with its bevel down, some superficial lens matter is removed, and then the phaco needle is turned to make the bevel up. The nucleus is pushed little down. The tip is buried into the substance of the nucleus. It goes little forward and then the nucleus is chopped. We have divided the nucleus into two heminuclei. Now each heminucleus is subdivided into two larger fragments. So we have got four pieces. Now each nuclear piece is tilted and emulsification is started from the apex of the triangular nuclear pieces. Ultrasonic energy used in this case is 70 percent. Flow rate is 45 ml per minute. Vacuum is 450 millimeter of mercury. Now this is the last nuclear fragment. At this time, we can either reduce the parameters to be on the safer side or we can control the foot switch with caution and manage the last piece. More caution is taken to remove this epinuclear shell. As the epinucleus is removed, the chopper has been removed to maintain the anterior chamber better. And now some visco filling up the anterior chamber. It will maintain the anterior chamber better and the possibility of touching the corneal endothelium by the Simco reduces. Now go through the side port and remove the cortex from the other side. So this is nice cleaning of the cortex and now a single piece monofocal intraocular lens is being implanted in the capsular bag. The antechamber is maintained by irrigation and this is known as hydro implantation of intraocular lens. A dialer is not required most of the time. 
you can manage with the irrigating cannula itself. Dialer means a sense key hook. And now this is a bit of moxie fluxacin. Then the side port is closed, hydrating corneal stroma with BSS. And now this is irrigation. This is the final antechamber lavage. The antechamber is formed very nicely and the case is concluded. Integrity of the own subject, few drops of moxie is applied and the case is concluded. Thank you very much for your attention. Hope this video will help you in developing your surgical skills. Be a great surgeon and serve your patients with love, respect, empathy and great surgical competence.